a war on men because a part of the plan of the enemy is to get rid of men. And one of the reasons for this is because of the authority that God had given to men. We live in a time now where we fail to recognize our place, who God made us to be. The devil wants men to lose their identity. God made woman not to compete with man, but God made the woman to complete man. And so a man without a woman is not fully complete. Can I talk to the church? And so we realize that it is the plan of the devil to remove man from the authority that God had given to them. And when the devil can't move them from the authority, then he decides to take their lives. Can I talk? To the church and we realize this that the role that God gave man is to be leaders and to be the ones who governs this earth but there's an authority that is in the house when a man is a part of the house no matter how that child is given trouble the man has the power she don't have to beat she don't have to take up a shop or she have to go to our mouth wait till your father oh god almighty wait till your father come and that set the children straight men have power and men have authority but the devil wants to remove men from being who they ought to be. But can I call to some men in Gravelin? Can I call to some men in Montego Bay? Can I call to some men in Jamaica and all over the world and let them know that God is calling men to take back their rightful positions. God is calling men to let them know God never invented you and make you to be a homosexual can I talk to somebody can I talk to somebody you see watch this we know here to homosexuals we hear the sin of homosexuality can I talk to somebody can I talk to somebody God made a man to be a real man so when you're a man you walk like man you talk like man you act that man, that guy gotta talk to somebody. No man risk, no fear bend too far than this. Man, they have some strength in them wrist. Gonna talk to somebody. If you're a man, you feel strong like a man, you feel talk like a man, you feel act like a man. Gonna talk to somebody. Women are everywhere, and women are looking for men to lead them. Women are looking for men to guide them. Women are looking for men to protect them. Can I talk to somebody? God is calling for men. I tell the young men that are there that in this church, in a few weeks' time, I soon bring somebody in to teach them how to do plumbing. Talk to somebody. I tell them that I soon bring somebody to teach them how to do some electrical work. Because as a man, some other one married and enough to chain like bull. Talk to me somebody. Talk to me somebody. I want you to understand that as a man, I feel like a superhero in my house. When my wife says, I want to switch to our function right. My God Almighty, when my wife said, What pipe a trip? Talk to me, somebody. Because me now will spend no money. I lose the opportunity. Because she said, But me never know, say you couldn't do that too. Talk to me, somebody. I said, Sometimes. 
time she asks me some stuff. And you want to see me go and let me know if you do it. Lord God. Sometimes the amount of foolishness. What did he do? I mean, mess up and sit them. I hide and go buy them back. And she don't know something mess them up. And when she come, she feel proud and give you a kiss from the job. And she don't know herself. If she look good in a screw down to her right. But I'm a man. And I got to leave. Talk to Mr. Bobby. I got to leave. I know who I am. And I know who God has made me to be open the mouth and in that door. Somebody worship God. Somebody put your hands together for the Lord. Somebody put your hands together for the Lord. Somebody put your hands together for the Lord. Don't leave, don't leave, don't leave that, don't leave that. Don't leave that. Every person that came to the altar today, the decision is yours today. If you want to serve him or not, if you're here today and you would like to make Jesus a choice before you go back to your seat and raise it again. Come on, put your hands together for the Lord. Put your hands together for the Lord. Come on, put your hands together for the Lord. Come on, put your hands together for the Lord. Check out your turn of messing to a message. Now the messenger arrived. Committed to the journey, so me now go backslide. Looking through the spirit and the physical eyes. Who to God me testify? Told me I the work of God and the boss. My whole life, he endured. Take me from the mud and put.